we're looking at uh, the lunar eclipse it's uh, 3 40 in the morning Sarasota Florida we're just about at the maximum of what we can handle with our equipment Here, we've got a picture on this one. In fact, let me just go ahead and take a photograph while I'm here. Two weeks, the rest of the stars bright. Okay, it's about four o'clock. And the, uh, the moon's just coming out of its eclipse. I don't know whether or not the camera is going to be recording the beautiful red color of the moon as it is right now, but it's the top uh, right corner is just beginning to illuminate. Just starting to come out of the eclipse. Oh, there's another shooting star. Hmm? There's another shooting star. Now this is just about four o'clock in the morning. You can see the top of the moon brightening right up again. That's better than the digital. In some ways the red was deeper and rosier at the height of the eclipse. Yeah, it's going to be brightest then. But, uh, it's fun to see it come out too. About five after four. In about an hour we'll have a full moon again. About 4.15, you can see the moon has kind of a white cap on it, like there's snow on the top of it, except it's in Florida. Florida moon doesn't have snow on it. It's coming out of the eclipse. Incredibly clear night, We're seeing shooting stars different places in the sky almost no moisture so that there's no real haze or anything in the air. I got my little video camera zoomed all the way in as far as the optical will go but I haven't gone up on the... That's back to the optical zoom. got to be fun sitting up on the moon watching the sunrise past the side of the earth as we get out of the way. But when we came out for the eclipse, um, we could see where the moon was. We could see the outline of the red, but it was so dark and so faint that we couldn't get any of our cameras to focus in on it. Of course, it's no problem now. You can see it very clearly in the sunrise is coming off the face of the moon. You see the shadow of the curve of the earth as it passes over the face of the moon. 
but it was so faint we couldn't even get our cameras to record. We had three different cameras, each one trying to capture it. And the red was so brilliant to our eyes, but we couldn't get enough light in the cameras to uh, get a very good picture, I don't think. Down to just the last quarter of the surface of the moon that still has the shadow over it. And I'm sure the video camera isn't doing it justice to be able to see the distinct line, the arc of the Earth shadow just retreating over the last quarter of the first surface of the moon. Just about a quarter to five. A newspaper guy just uh, appeared in the neighborhood. Dropping off the Sarasota Herald.